Let me start out by saying what anyone who knows me already knows, and that's that I hands down love NSCC. It seems like forever ago when I went out to the mailbox and found that little light at white envelope that would change my life. Knowing that I was going to be in the graduating class of 2015, I knew that NSCC would be where dreams and goals come together and take flight. Congratulations, you've officially completed your programs. Well done. I was told I wasn't capable and that I didn't have the stamina. And, and they said I was just too darn old. I proved them wrong. I worked hard by taking many different courses to make my dream a reality. Everyone in this room has a story about what brought them here and what carried them through the long road to graduation. I, for one, would not be standing here today if it wasn't for the love and support from my beautiful wife and two little girls. I returned to NSCC not just for me, but for my family, so that I could provide a better life for them. So let's extend our thanks to our family and friends and everyone else who were there to help us when we needed it most. With so many uh, bonds and friendships being made, not only within our own programs, but throughout the whole campus, we really put the community in community college. Am I right? It amazes me the diversity that is represented here. I couldn't have asked for a more empowering group of people to surround myself with in my two years here. For the women here today, staff and students that have chosen to be involved in something that is considered untraditional, thank you. To the men here who have chosen something considered untraditional, thank you. Thank you to the instructors who have stood by us, nurtured our education, pushed us to excel in spite of ourselves, who took the time to recognize our potential and encourage us to strive for a higher education. Your efforts and dedication have not gone unnoticed and your sacrifices are equal to our own. As an adult learner, I really appreciate the flexibility of the faculty around our lives and that we're treated with respect and dignity. In addition, Donna, we have received the best cafeteria food that I'm sure the world has ever seen. With honors. We were front and center when former president of NSCC, Ray Ivany, released what would become our future's action plan, the One Nova Scotia Report. When you think of your portfolio, it contains your goals, learning narratives, self-assessments, and your favorite work samples. This is our life at the core. If the grass looks greener on the other side, stop staring, stop comparing, stop complaining, and start watering the grass you're standing on. The great majority of Nova Scotia employers will say to job applicants who graduate from NSCC, come in. The class of 2015 hosts future CEOs, business owners, community leaders, and activists. This shift from students to workers will grant us with even more power to shape both our local and global communities. We will persist through adversity, we will build accepting communities, and we will ensure that this world is better for having had us in it. It's time to get to work. <laughs>